by the way, so this is the calcium carbonate. You see what it's doing there. Okay, this is the calcium oxide. That's some hard shit stuff. That's calcium oxide too. Oh. It's a lot lighter than this. <laughs> All right, getting back to the task at hand. We need to test this burner. Mechanics, the basic mechanics of this. This is a stop valve. This should be a gate valve, but all I could find is a stop valve at the time when I now needed something. My air supply comes in here. It comes straight in, and then it shoots up, and then it shoots out, which I was okay with because I knew I had way too much air force in it to begin with. Um, so then it comes up here. Now, this is where gas is introduced. As you can see, gas gets introduced here. There is a god like a, a 1770 force or something like that hole drilled in a cap there because um, i couldn't fit a mig tip in there so those two collide and they come through here now once it gets into this pipe i have put that little impeller in there all right you can see the end of it there still bright from the cut it did not heat up at all which tells me that the flame stayed out of the tube that's a good sign. That is a good sign. So going back to the mechanics, it starts mixing here, but once it reaches this point, this is where it comes into that impeller motion. And it starts spiraling up. And at some point, it hits a stop. And it tries to shift back the other way, which slows it down, which creates a back pressure back here, which shoves all this into that, super concentrating everything, bellowing in there, and then it's just back the other way, and it spirals on out. By the time it gets here, it should be spiraling out here, which I think is why we had that big dragon's breath coming out, which is awesome, because this isn't really much of a um, flare, so I don't know. We're going to see if it'll light off here in a minute. So that's the basic idea of it. We are going to run it. Let me turn the gas off. And I was running it at four or five. That right there is two. All right, let's see what it's doing at two. Igniter's ready. Let's see what happens. Not even wanting the light outside the foundry. I need to drop the air pressure. Not a whole lot coming out there. Here we go. Two pounds of pressure, let's introduce some air. What I'm seeing is two screens. I'm seeing it. It's, it looks like it's pushing that way as well as up that way. So it's spiraling out of there. That is very interesting. I'm going to go ahead and increase it up to um, 5 PSI. Increase the air pressure. Five PSI. Absolutely insane. If you come back this way, you kind of see how it's fanning out. That's five PSI. I ran this thing at ten the other day. We're going to crank it up to 10 since the heck happens. Need more air. We are sitting here at 10 PSI, and I want you to see exactly what's going on here. You can really see it now. Well, you might not. Let's see it. Where's your lens? There we go. So, you can kind of see what's going on there. Um, 
it is spiraling out of there and it is fanning out tremendously. So the heat distribution is awesome. If I got two of these side by side, I think I'm going to have great distribution. I'm going to buy an inch and a quarter coupling and uh, grind down the, the threads on the inside on one side of it, screw it on there and see what we get then. Since we can increase the velocity, maybe increase the spiral off. Might not work, might have to go with this, but that's just, uh, that's pretty awesome stuff right there, man. I, I really like that, I really like that. You got some shooting this way, and you got some shooting this way, but when it comes out, both strings are opening up, and they're collecting, and I'm getting an awesome distribution there. Just a great distribution. That's a 10 PSI, so, not 15, 10. Uh, and that might be a little weak. There we go, there's some more air. You know, to hook that in the back of my boat. There's my new engine. Jet propulsion, baby. And by the way, I just barely had the fuel cracked open. Let's see how many turns are left on this. There's a half. There's one, one and a half, two, three, four, four and a half, all right, four and three quarters of a turn left to open it all the way. Now, let's see how many it takes to close it all the way. So, half, one, four, five. So... Only had it open a quarter, just cracked open. So I had the air just cracked open. I got the gas just cracked open. Really unexpected. All I wanted the damn thing to do was just mix the, the fuel up well. I didn't expect it to blow out a freaking mountain of blue havoc the way it did. So, uh, yay! Screw a ribbon burner. Yes, I am recording this while laying in bed because it's my night night time. Because I'm me. Why would I want to be anybody else? There's no fun being normal. What's normal? That's in the eye of the beholder. Because what's normal to me, weird to you. And what's weird to you, could be normal to somebody else. So, hope you enjoyed this video. See you next time. And hey, keep heating and beating, baby.